Some of the most beautiful structures and buildings have been erected from what we might consider old and run down. The historical building Beard and Lady Inn in Chester, Arkansas continues to go through renovations that will leave you wondering what is next. Let's talk to owner Lacey Hendricks. Hey guys, welcome back to the Beard and Lady Inn. I am super excited to show you all the progress that we've been making. Um, finally have a little bit of paint on the walls. This is the mercantile store side of the hotel, original from the 1887s, and we're hoping to bring it back as an old mercantile store, maybe sell some of our Beard and Lady products and a few other things. Um, right behind us before we walk in, these windows with the bank signs were in the movie Frank and Jesse. I think I might leave them since it's a part of the unique history of the hotel. Come inside, let me show you what we've got going on. This spot right here where I'm standing is actually an area that I'm super excited about. When we first purchased the building, this was the scariest spot and didn't really know what we were gonna get into, but we knew it would be a lot of work. Uh, the floor from the back wall to kind of about where I'm at, we started to pull up some of the old boards and the floor joists literally were covered in like white slime mushrooms. Um, it didn't have ventilation in the building and moisture had just built up because there had been a lot of um, water and rain damage from the roof that we had, we've already put a new roof on the building. And so to be standing here with a hardwood floor and in a dry area, I'm super excited about. Plus, it gave us the opportunity to kind of rethink what we wanted to do with the space and decided that we would put in a stage. So we're hoping to be uh, an, a space that people can come for events, live music, um, my children are hoping to put on some talent shows, <laughs> whatever we can utilize it for to bring the community together, and that's what we're here for. So I'm really, really excited about what this is going to kind of create for Chester and anybody who wants to come see us at the Bearded Lady Inn. Let me show you around for a sec. So right behind me is actually where there was like this very strange structure, kind of a, I think it was like a blacksmith, maybe part of a store that was here before. So we took all of that down and revealed the brick wall behind us. It's incredible how the plaster, that's the painted part that you see, actually how well preserved it's been. Um, we decided to leave this section of the brick exposed so you could kind of see the basically the original brick and then the plaster over it and how well preserved it's been kept. I actually, I love this part and corner of the building. Um, also in the stage area, we've left all of the brick exposed. And thankfully, we've been able to dry it out and keep it to what it is and it hasn't needed anything else. It just needed some, a little bit of love. So I hope you guys will also get to come see the space and love it just as much as I do. So these shelves that you see behind me that span the length of the building, nearly 70 foot, I think on both sides, are original, um, historic from about 1887, and they were built and then brought down with on the railroad from the Frisco Rail Line to the hotel. Um, so I think this is one of the most exciting parts of the building that has been kept and saved, and we hope to utilize them as soon as we're open for business and to fill the shelves with all kinds of goods from Beard and Lady products to even maybe a small type of grocery store for the community of Chester. And I am super excited to see a fresh coat of paint on them. So this is a big reveal for me. Um, some girls in a mural, Stacy, actually came and painted our Beard and Lady logo and gave it a little bit of, um, a little bit of spice and some beautiful gold foiling and botanicals. I'm super, super excited about this. And this will be the space that Beard and Lady will be set up as a shop and we hope to get to meet customers face to face, hopefully sometime coming soon this summer. Um, we cannot wait to meet people, we can't wait to get to invite everybody into this space and see what all the hard work that we've been doing here at the Beard and Lady.